Well, good morning, my friends. I just posted a new graphic for my channel, I guess. This is Facebook, but you know, whatevs. And I am starting the morning out right. I got my tea, I've got my peanut butter toast with flax, I've got a couple pieces of bacon, and um, I loaded up my knife a little bit too much, so that's extra, and that's going to this guy right here, right? It's been sitting up here for a little while, very diligently. I haven't even touched my meal yet. You want this? Hey, hold on. You gotta calm down. No, no. All right, you ready? Okay, go. Hello, hello friends, and welcome to the vlog. I think before this I might have shown my breakfast and Doyle, I don't remember. Anyway, hi, it is Wednesday, so I am going to Michael's. I did a bunch of online ordering, but I did like the pickup in store because there was a deal. Plus, the uh, containers that I need to get are were all on sale at the time. So, I don't know if they're still on sale now, but it's like my washi storage. So, all of the Michaels that are close to me don't have them anymore because I bought them all. Whoops. And um, I just need more. So, I'm going to go pick those up. And there was only a few available at a bunch of locations. So, I'm going to three different locations today and um, picking those up. But um, I bought them oh, a couple of days ago and uh, they're ready for pickup now. But my dad's calling. Okay, sorry about that. My dad was calling. Apparently he doesn't know how to ship returns back to Amazon. So now I'm not leaving my house. I'm going to their house to go pick up the package. And then I have to go to the UPS store, which um, the closest one is like 30 miles away. So yeah. But it's kind of on my way anyway, so it's fine. But um, yeah, it's like, I don't know. He's like on the struggle bus about this like return. And um, he sent me the links to bring or to, um, you know, have the like scannable shipping label and the scannable return thing a while ago, like last week. And he still hasn't done anything with it. So <laughs> I don't I don't know. I have no idea. He's like, how do you return stuff? I'm like, you return it. Like, look at the shipping label. Is it for like UPS? Is it USPS? Like, what's it for? So he's like, oh, I don't know. So it's UPS, it's UPS. So anyway, whoa. All right, I'm turning and um, I'll see you guys a little bit later. Okay, so on my way to my adventures, I realized um, Doyle needs pet food. <laughs> Oops. Whoopsie dupsie. Um, if you're interested, here's what he gets. I get him the natural balance, limited ingredient, potato and duck. That's what he gets. But here's my question. I think this one fits my container better than that one. Yeah, I think I'm gonna get the smaller one. Yeah, we're gonna go with this. Oh, this is the puppy formula. He's on a puppy. Where's the old man formula? All right. This is what I want. Ta-da, it's in my cart now. All right, and of course, I gotta go, like, I have to look around. It's like a requirement of going to Petco, right? All right, so I bought a few other things, but I wanted to do a little puppy haul, so let's do that. We're gonna do a Petco haul. All right, so I got a Firminator. I have like an old school Firminator that doesn't have like the little, like, little retractable thing on there. And uh, I had a little a picking session with Doyle's fluff today. So it was time to get one of these finally. And um, I got him a new leash. We use a retractable leash. And I know there's lots of controversy about retractable leashes. This is what works well for me and Doyle. I've never had an issue with him on a retractable leash. So you know, I'm just trying to alleviate the comments. So, um, yeah, but it works really well for us. And um, I really enjoy retractable leashes because he likes his privacy when he pees. I have tried like the regular leashes, they just don't work. And then I got him a collar. This is from Good To Go Collar. This is in the small. He has kind of a funny neck. Like he has a really fat neck, but 
the issue becomes that his actual neck, like where he needs the collar, is a little bit smaller. So um, I got him a small, because if I remember right, last time I got him a collar, it was also a small, but I needed it at the largest setting. So it's kind of playing with it in the store, and it's got kind of like, it's a black um, fabric, uh, it's just like a regular fabric. It's not like nylon. And then it's got kind of this like cream Aztec design on it, which I thought was kind of cool. And you know me, I love neutral things. I also got him a little rope tug toy. I don't think I have any of these currently in his bin of things. Um, I did have some other ones previously, but they get kind of like gummed up and gross. So this time for a new one of those. And then this is so funny. And I love all things neutral toys. Like I have lots of browns and creams and blacks and whites and stuff of like, you know, toys. Because it doesn't look like that bad when his toys are all like strewn about. Anyway, but this is from Leaps and Bounds. It's a Tuffometer. The Tuffometer is gentle, it says, and it's a play plush. Anything else about this? Um, and this is the. French loaf underwear is what it's called. So this is like a loaf of bread and it's like a French baguette, get it? And he's got like a little, you know, hat and the little mustache. And this part is like crinkly, which is like the, the loaf. And it says, just loafing around, which I think is hilarious because my dog literally loafs around. But look at this, are you ready? And it goes, ooh la la, <laughs> he's got his underpants. <laughs> so funny. Oh, this is kind of ruining it. But oh my gosh, isn't that hilarious? Ooh la la! <laughs> and it's got, a, it's got a good squeaker in it. And then this is crunchy. Doyle loves this stuff. So, anyway. Ooh la la is going right back in. <laughs> but isn't that hilarious? Like, ah! <laughs> oh, I thought it was funny. I'm like, yep, I'm gonna need that. So anyway, now I'm gonna go off and do the things that I was supposed to. Oh, and I did get the food, it's in the back seat. But um, yeah, so I'm gonna go to my first of three Michaels now. And I'll see you guys in a little bit. So I am home and I have unpacked my car about 80% of the way. But surprise, the mom's here. Hi. Huh. I was like, hello. Uh, uh. <laughs> she called while I was out and said, hey, where are you at? I said, I'm in Maple Grove, where are you at? She's like, I wanna come over and roll some laundry. I'm like, okay, go ahead. So she's been here. I've got all my bins. It's a lot, guys, it's a lot. But um, I haven't eaten any lunch today. I had some breakfast, which was delicious, but um, I haven't had any lunch and I was telling my mom, you know, dessert sounds delicious right now. I think I want dessert first, dinner after. She doesn't know what I got, and neither do you guys, because I didn't show you slash tell you. I got these, shh, don't tell her. All right, but we're gonna, I'm gonna show her on camera, so hold on a second. Okay, let's deliver it. Here you go. Oh my gosh, look at that. I told one you it was different. <laughs> one of those famous cupcakes. Yes. From, where is it? Na Na Nadia's. Nadia's. Yep. We got oh. Nadia's cupcakes. These oh, are, are the best. her famous cheesecake cupcakes. They're so good. I don't know why anyone else gets anything else there. Just get this. Hey, Doyle, get down. Do we have to share this one? Um, no. Oh, good. Oh, she oh. wasn't sharing anyway. <laughs> Just checking. Yep. I gotta feed, gotta feed the mother for uh, <laughs> for helping. We'll work for foods. <laughs> And they had pup cakes there. And Doyle has a little, look at this, that's a little pup cake. I think I'm gonna um, cut this in half. Here's the pup cake. It's super cute. Do you wanna see the super cute pup cake before I, uh... well, he could probably eat the whole thing. Oh, isn't that cute? Yeah, and it's made with like pumpkin and like, oh, all that, that good, good stuff, stuff that little dog would like. Whoa! Whoa! Nice. Alright, okay. Never mind, change of plans. I think I'm gonna give him the whole thing. Here's Doyle's cupcake. Doyle, you have to get down on the ground though. Come on, down. Get down. 
Okay, here. All right, there you go. It's like, oh man. <laughs> Did you need me to do something to it? You can't just bite it? You're just gonna lick it? Okay. I'm gonna do something different here. <laughs> Use my spoon. Cut it up. Can I cut it up? Oh! Oh! oh gosh. <laughs> I tried to cut it up. No! 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 Don't take it over there. Ah, oh. oh, Doyle! What the hell? <laughs> He's just walking around with it in his mouth. Okay, just eat it. Just eat it. You're fine. <laughs> you don't. Oh, God, dog. You're so nasty. <laughs> All right, well, he's gonna be here for a while. Um, yeah, I'm just gonna leave him alone. <laughs> oh my gosh. He's getting frosting all over the carpet, but he'll just lick it up because that's what dogs do. <laughs> oh my goodness. Okay, I'm gonna eat my cake now too. Ha-ha! Okay, so the parrots are gone. They have been fed. They are happy. That is good. And I got my dishwasher going. Ta-da! And then um, this baking dish, however, did not fit because I already had kind of a full dishwasher to begin with. So, yeah. So I am just... Hanging out now. I don't know what else to uh, specifically report on today. Hmm, I don't know. I got nothing, guys. I got nothing left. But yeah, today was a busy day of just running around and shopping. <laughs> so, ah, it was kind of intense, but it was good. It was, a, it was a good intense. But I think I'm going to just hang out for the rest of the day. I may import this footage right now, just to have it. I might dabble in a little bit of editing tonight too, because tomorrow my brother is going to be in town and we are gonna go grab some lunch and hang out. The dog's over there doing dog things. <laughs> so yeah, I think I'm gonna close it out here. Um, I feel like I didn't have a lot of footage today and I do apologize, but you know, I was busy running errands and shopping and doing all that stuff. Oh, the reason I didn't do a lot of vlogging while I was in the shops is because everywhere I went, besides Petco, <laughs> had so many people in the aisles. And I was thinking like, oh, it's the middle of the day. Like, nobody's gonna be here. Oh, I was wrong. <laughs> there was a lot of people there. And I couldn't find like a free aisle to myself to like, you know, whatever. Just chat with you guys. I was really only there to pick up my online purchases anyway. So it was kind of like a quick in and out situation but yeah that's gonna be it for today thank you guys so much for watching the vlogs if you like it give it a thumbs up comment on something fun that i said or did tomorrow you'll see the favorite brother that's kind of exciting right so um subscribe for more and um i will see you guys tomorrow in the next video bye guys well folks it's time to kick it old school uh, so you can feel cool <laughs> give it to my baby